by, by no question my favorite light source is the laser beam. I mean, that's a, that's a light, it's like totally outerworldly. It's not comparable to anything natural that we have on Earth. So it's very, yeah, it feels alien, kind of. And I like the property that you basically see the beam of the light as something almost physical. You're almost afraid to touch it because you think it, you know, it might cut you because it's so strong and so so visible in space, and it gives you uh, a lot of options that you don't have with other light sources, like doing vector drawing basically in in 3D space. And but the main property about this, if you look really close, it has this, I don't know, moving micro texture to it, and the closer you look, the the more details you see. Nothing will never reemplace. A bottle of champagne and a candle. The candle is a dynamic light source. It's not steady. So there is a difference in what you see immediately. There's the kind of softly flickering light. This is one, uh, one thing about it. The second thing is uh, it's a warm color temperature. People look good. You look at a good looking person and you think you are look good looking as well. It's very important. <laughs> A lack of light and a lack of light sources sometimes is the nicest thing to experience. Now the gaslight is molten gold, completely different than anything else that we have. And it really speaks of a, an industrial history and a beautiful optics in terms of the lenses of the lanterns and a sensibility. So to me, the gas lantern is the, the ultimate light. But the sunlight hits the, the sea bottom, ideally with a white sand, maybe. And you have those dancing beams and you are in all this. And, and, and you think, well, this is a, a, such a blessful, beautiful moment. You know, this beautiful building called New York Life Building, which is a, basically a gold leaf eight-story tall pyramid and then when that's all lit up uh, basically the sky when we have fog for literally about an eight or ten block area it just turns gold so it is quite different from the asian you know lighting designers and the european lighting that we very much appreciate for a little higher color temperature and the moonlighting effect even for the little bluish one Natural light, natural light. <laughs> Fire. And after that, LED. LED, absolutely. Well, the favorite light source is obviously LED because of the way that I can apply and play with it. Uh, it uh, just gives the, the, the widest range of uh, creative opportunity.